This is a demo of the joy detector of the AIY Vision Kit. So here is me smiling. And it turns orange, yellow on top. And then here's me frowning. And it lights up blue if I'm frowning and it lights up yellow orange if I am smiling. So that was a quick demo of the AIY Vision Kit with the joy detection assembled out of the box. Hi everyone, this is Caroline. In this video, I am assembling the AIY Vision Kit. I just purchased this from Target. This is the edition that was released April 2018. It is a V1.1 version. The original version did not include a camera, nor did it include the Raspberry Pi. This includes a Raspberry Pi Zero W with headers and the camera as well. So let's get started. So we'll start with the unboxing right now. The only thing it doesn't include is a USB power supply. I'm gonna use the USB power supply that came with my smartphone. According to the instructions, the way you know if your USB power adapter is compatible with this kit is if the output is two amps. So it, in tiny print on your USB power adapter, if it says two amps, you should be good to go. The other thing I figured out while doing this project is that a power bank charger will also work with the joy detector as well. This kit is for ages 14 and up. Hey, you adults out there, don't feel like this is a kid project. Now, out of the box, it's going to work with something called joy detection. I just demoed that a few minutes ago, and it does not require an internet connection. So the website is e.co uh, forward slash AIY projects, and then it's a redirect to AIY projects with google.com, and then I'm going to click on vision kit, and here we go. Here's the vision kit. Let's start, uh, so let's, let's start scrolling down here. We've checked our version already. I know what version I have. Let's start with the hardware assembly. First, we're going to build the internal frame. Pull the connector hatch up a little bit. They said fingernails are good. All right, we're gonna insert the long flex into the hatch. All right, so here is our long flex. We're going to insert it with the black on top and the connections facing down. And then we're gonna close the connector hatch. And flip it over. Okay, so now I can see part of that adhesive right there, the adhesive flap that I just folded. Okay, let's see. And now we're ready to add the camera. And then flip on the other side. So now we're gonna fold down the top flap and fold the left and right flaps. And fold the bottom flap. All right, I sense a theme here. And here it is, it looks like a little shelf now. That's what they said, it should look like a little shelf. Thread the button wire. And then fold the long flex up and to the left. And we're gonna thread the long flex and then back through the middle slit. And then back through the other slit. All right. Now that we've finished building the internal frame, next we will connect the boards. 
This is the Raspberry Pi Zero W board with the AIY hat. Orient my Raspberry Pi, okay. And then I want to open the top cable connector. I think this is gonna work just like we did the other, the other side of the cable connector right here. Pull that out. Then we're gonna insert the short flex. And the ends are labeled. So one is labeled Vision Bonnet, one is labeled Raspberry Pi. All right, so, and the copper stripe should be facing away from me. Then I'll push back down the cable connector, check that it's latched. And now we orient our vision bonnet. If the, if the tiny black latch is at a right angle with the white base, then it is open. If the black latch is flush and parallel with the top of the white base, it is closed. Okay, so my, mine is already open. Insert the short flex. The, the side with the copper stripes and labels is facing away from me as shown in the picture this as far as I can go and then I can flip down and it is now attached look at that woohoo all right flip it over make sure they're on the right sides okay vision bonnet raspberry pi insert the standoffs and they're inserting them on the raspberry pi board side all right so this is going to connect to this and so we need to insert the standoffs on the other side and then we're going to line the boards and magic is going to happen here. I'm going to push all the pins together, I'm going to push the, the standoffs together and it should all fit down perfectly. And there we go. We've aligned all the pins. Everything is flush now and we should flex it. It, it does say flex it inside as well. Now that we have the boards connected, let's add it to our internal frame. Now, we're up to the section where I'm adding boards to the frame. All right, let's see. So, uh, orient my board and then connect the boards and the frame. With the copper stripes on the long flex facing away from me, connect it to the white cable connector. And then flip the black latch and the parallel state to close it. Closing it and it is now in place. Now I'm going to slide the board into the frame. I can see Vision Bonnet right here and I think that correlates to the picture. Check frame and cables. Now we're ready to plug in the button harness. Plug that in. You can also remove the white tag. Okay, let's do that. That was step 41. Now I'm ready to move on to step 42. Orient the box. Let me go get the box. Now we're ready to build the outside box. Here is the box. Okay, A. This is this is great. This is just like holding a box. And they said start with the letter A. Okay, I'm sensing a theme. Okay, started with the letter A. Folded that up. Now fold up B. Hmm, didn't see that coming. All right, B. Now fold C. C is now here. While holding A and B in, fold the C toward you, okay, and then peel the adhesives, flaps labeled A, A, okay. Peeling off the adhesives on A, okay, C, holding that up, fold flap D onto both of the A flaps. Insert the tripod nut, fold E in, and fold F. The E goes inside right here. And then remove the adhesive on E. Fold over the right flap labeled G and, and the arrows should face each other. Yes, the arrows are facing each other. Secure the other side. Let's do that so you can see all this. And then fold the bottom flap. Okay, hopefully that's the bottom flap. Fold down H. Now that we've got our outside box built and our internal boards in the internal frame, we're going to put it together. Now, 
will slide in the internal frame. But I'm just going to go ahead and remove the adhesive from the camera. I've, I've slid the internal frame into the cardboard box. Check the boards and the wires. Ensure the Raspberry Pi and the Vision Bonnet are still sitting snugly in the inner frame and that everything is still attached. There is a privacy LED and an LED bezel. Okay. All right, so here's the LED bezel. Here is the privacy LED. So flip your box to the front side and put the, push the LED bezel into the top left hole. Okay, install the privacy LED from, I'm assuming the back here. All right, there it is. Now there's the privacy LED right here and here is the uh, vision camera. Now we're going to install the button here. You thread the wires through the nut first. The larger, the wider section of the nut should be facing up. Thread all the wires through right here. And then we're going to take the cables and thread thread them through, take all the cables, thread them up. Now we're gonna plug everything in. That just popped right in. Next we're gonna do the privacy buzzer. And then last but not least, we are going to plug in. This is the bonnet connector right here. And that pops right in. And then we'll insert the push button back into the box. Screw on the nuts here and check my completed box and then we're ready to close up the box. And here is my vision kit. This is, this is an 8 gig micro SD card. I'm assuming it's already flashed and it needs to be inserted just like you would uh, your Raspberry Pi. So I'm going to insert it contacts facing down. It says with the arrow side facing up, insert your SD card into the silver slot which you can find through the cutout labeled SD card. Okay, we have fully assembled our brand new AIY vision kit here. Let's plug it in and see if it works. Right here, it says power on the right side. I am going to take the power adapter and plug it in right here. And my phone charger ready to go here. And we're gonna plug it in all together. And it will take about four minutes the first time you boot this up. And then afterwards, it should take about two minutes for it to boot up and it will boot straight into the joy detector. So I will be right back. Hopefully you heard that. That is the sound of our joy detector ready to go in our AIY vision kit. Let's give it a try right now. Smiling. And it lit up yellow, red on the top when it sensed that I was smiling. Now I'm gonna to try to frown. Okay, yeah, there, then it turned blue when, it, when I frowned. Uh, and I think that's about it in terms of the initial project. Smiling, frowning, and, uh, and it seems to work. So try this out, uh, see if you can get this going and continue watching me on YouTube. Please subscribe to my channel and we will continue with this kit next week.